figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, says the man who is most to blame for this catastrophe. How convenient. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Any, they just fucking found angle, it. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing? The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing's certain yet. Well, find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing oh, we man, need is all the fake town like knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes, sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Massage? Why do you say it like that? Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. Oh no, I was say you're an asshole. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, I guess I should have listened to you and waited. Wasn't gonna say I told you so. You don't have to say it. It would have been better to have more to offer. When the fuck didn't she listen? Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. What an asshole. Yep. That was about an eight on the asshole scale. Asshole scale? Well, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> is... is he gone? Yes, thankfully. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. Aww. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? <laughs> it hasn't been a great morning, Buffkin. Sorry. Eh, not your fault. Thanks for asking, though. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. Not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. No. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. Oh, the mirror. I really have to get this appointment. Mirror, mirror away, on the wall. Who's let me the know if you need anything. Hey, magic mirror. I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> Mirror, mirror, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See, was that so hard? That'd be yeah, awesome. About two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Um, woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Buffkin. Show me Buffkin. Look, his eyes lit up. Hey! Put down the bottle and get to work. Still looking. Aww. Show no. me Snow White. Not much of a request. 
She's in this very room. Look, I want you to spy on her, okay? Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Something over here. Oh, what is this? Oh, I didn't mean to look. I'm gonna touch. Oh, use. Oh, they're tarot cards. I guess it comes in all forms. Whoa. That's the last one. I'm gonna see the last one. Show me the last one. Wow. What the fuck is this supposed to mean? Oh, I got a tarot card. Oh, <gasps> magic lamp. Worth a try. No, oh, it didn't work. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, I think I've been everywhere. We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. There's the wolf. Hmm. Me. The woodsman. Uh. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. Oh yeah, Snow White. The Red Modern Hood. Uh, Beauty. The Beast. What is that? Colin and his brothers. Oh. I don't know who that is. Who's that? I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could be her father, or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. What is that? Oh, great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bufkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. <laughs> okay, let's go forward. Is that the sign? This looks familiar. Yes. From the Acts of the Woodsman, oh. a druid blessing, actually. Someone blessed that thing. I only translate. Um. To that? What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the no. Frog Prince. I don't remember what it looked like. I'm looking for. Okay. Oh, is that? This Fuck. is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelairo. I'll go look it up. Alelairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as. 
Ass skin. <laughs> it prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, his daughter, Faith. Wow. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. So her name is Faith. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. So I should go back to the... We what we came for. The yeah. mirror. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than Her we... Her name was Faith. 